There's no rules with this installation. It's absolutely for each individual who comes into the room to find in it whatever they want. Kindertorten Leader is a five room installation, five rooms built within one larger room. And each of these rooms is a very intimate, domestic, private space where there's a song and a film. And the subject matter of the songs is it's very moving. It's all about reflections on, on the death of children. But the filmic element that Marila brings to it is always takes a kind of angle on that. So it's a lot of summer landscapes, the sun setting behind a very, very beautiful Swiss mountain. As a viewer, you're, you're reflecting optimistically or at least thoughtfully on, on material which could be utterly depressing. So it kind of puts it into a really beautiful juxtaposition between hope and, and despair. They were all built in Bristol and then transported flat-packed up to Leeds uh, before Christmas. And then it took about a week to, uh, in a kind of an Ikea-like way, to get them out of their boxes, screw them all together, and then the real business begins. I, could, I suppose it starts very, very big, um, you know, with lots of hammering and sawing, and then as you get further down the process, everything gets tinier and tinier until you're adjusting just the very tiniest little angles on a projector and the angle of a, of a speaker so that the sound is just so. The English words of the songs are the first thing that you see. When you go into each of the rooms, they're telling you uh, exactly what it is that the song is singing about. So immediately you, you're through that barrier. Some people are coming in, walking around in you know, record time, rushing from room to room, thinking, OK, I've, I've got what I wanted and leaving. Other people are sitting down in one room and spending 10, 20 minutes just, just in that room. It's all about the individual and how, how you want to respond to the work and what you want to take away with you afterwards. There's, there's no right or wrong.